In this video, I'm going to show you guys the best method to get infinite clover coins in Pet Simulator X. So inside the brand new update, they added a brand new St. Patrick's event where you need clover coins to purchase the new eggs. And I'm going to show you guys the best ways to get tons of them in this video. So yeah, let's get into it right now. Alright, so the best way I found to get clover coins... At least the manual way is to go ahead and break stuff in the cat kingdom. As you can see, if I break all this stuff, I get a decent amount of coins with also no boost. Well, no server boost at least. But yeah, I'm still getting a pretty good amount of coins. You can see I've already gotten a billion and it hasn't even been that long. And if I had the boost, I would be getting way more coins. So if you want to manually grind coins, this is pretty much the best way. Or if you want to AFK grind coins, I suggest you guys use the throne cat room. As you can see, I'm getting a decent amount per tick with also no server boost. But yeah, I want to show you guys an even better way. And that being the daycare. I think a lot of people forgot about the daycare. As you can see, if I go ahead and claim all my pets, I just got 186 billion clover coins for literally doing nothing. So yeah, as you can see, if I enroll all of my pets... At the bare minimum, I would be getting 40 billion clover coins, and the maximum being almost 4 trillion. So yeah, the daycare is by far the best way to get clover coins, and it also requires no work. Like, all I have to do is just throw my pets into the daycare and wait 2 hours, or 6 hours if you go offline, and you'll have so many clover coins. And also make sure you go ahead and grind the pot of gold event when it does come, because the egg you can open for an hour is the best egg in the game by far. It is definitely the most expensive, however, if you use the daycare, it shouldn't even be that hard. But yeah, as you can see, this is the Lucky Kingdom egg, which is the best egg in the game besides when the event is here. And it literally only costs 1.2 million. Like, I can open this egg for so long and it wouldn't even take a toll in how many coins I have. So yeah, the daycare is definitely the most overpowered way. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and open up this egg for a while. We wanna make sure I pop some server boosts. And yeah, it's time to open up this egg, so wish me luck. Alright boys, we are back, and if I open my inventory, as you can see, I hatched a huge shiny leprechaun cat. So yeah, I definitely got pretty lucky already with this event, as you can see, it looks pretty cool as well. But yeah, also already 5,000 exists, and the update literally just came out, so it's not gonna be very rare. But yeah, I literally opened up coins overnight, and it didn't even take a toll in how many I lost. And all I have to do is come back over here to the daycare and get 200 billion more coins. So yeah, this daycare is literally so overpowered. I also hatched three rainbow clover unicorns, as you can see as well. Pretty cool. But yeah, let's put those back in the machine. There we go. And I also hatched a ton of secret pets, as you can see. I literally hatched so many. But yeah, I'm curious how many of the other huge pets exist. Alright, so we have 1,135 huge clover unicorns and 456 huge clover dragons already. So yeah, these things are not going to be worth very much at all. But yeah, it's still pretty cool that I did hatch a shiny. But yeah, if you guys are not using the daycare already, I highly suggest you guys do. And if you guys have the Robux, make sure to get an extra 10 pet slots. Because it literally helps so much. And also for some reason, I just realized, but they removed the wrap for the huge clover pets they just added. I have no clue why they did this, but as you can see, like, all the other pets do have wrap. So I guess for pets that are inside of the game, they won't have wrap. But once they go away and become limited, they will gain wrap again. So yeah, definitely pretty interesting they did that. Along with also removing the titanic wrap like I mentioned in the last- And they also removed the titanic wrap as well. I'm also not sure if these lucky blocks give any huge pets as well. They might give huge pets, but if they do, it is the same ones inside of the eggs. So yeah, these lucky blocks are definitely not very useful at all. It is way more beneficial to just open the eggs. But yeah, that pretty much is everything in the video. 
Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel so you guys know if I upload future videos. And yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.